Hey everybody, it's Chainsaw. The Furious 7 official Super Bowl spot has just been released online, so let's waste no more time. Let's watch the new Furious 7 trailer. The most important thing in life will always be family. The people right here, right now. Dominic Toretta. You don't know me. You're about to. Looks like the sins of London have followed us home. Remember Owen Shaw? This is a big bad brother. We're being hunted. I'm going with you. Mm. One last ride. That is not gonna work. Oh my god. This takes crazy to a whole nother level. Yeah. What's up now? Oh. What? No, no, no. <laughs> oh my god. Oh. Jesus. <laughs> oh god. Okay. 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 <laughs> okay, so we had couple of the same shots, uh, the one especially where they jump out of the plane and they have parachutes for their cars. Um, before I get to that final shot, that what the F moment, <laughs> um, I like that it started off before the Jason Statham call, that it was focusing on the family aspect, which they kind of ended the first trailer with, you know, uh, they're not my friends, they're family, and it shows Paul Walker in the front. We had a couple more shots of Paul Walker, and he's saying, I'm coming with you or whatever, when they're going to go take this out, take this guy out. Um, one last ride, you know? And uh, It's not really been confirmed, but I think they're going to continue the franchise, and they're going to retire the Paul Walker character, which is smart um, if they want to continue the franchise. But uh, I really uh, enjoyed that trailer. Uh, we had some dramatic moments, some really action-packed moments. The Rock with a freaking machine gun, and he's just out in the middle of the street, just blowing crap up. And that WTF moment, the the shot where a car flies out of a huge skyscraper building into another building, and then Vin Diesel jumps out, and then he almost falls over as the car plummets down after it goes through the second building and completely goes out. <laughs> I'm really curious about that scene, because how in the world is there... First of all, how'd the car get up there to the sky... How, how'd it get up there in that skyscraper? Is there an elevator the size of a car to put it up there? And is that physically possible to drive a car? <laughs> I know the, it's, a, it's just a lot of stupid questions, but man, that's how intense it was. You saw my reaction. Oh my god, that final stunt with that car is ridiculous. But, insane. That's what you come to expect from these films. They always up the game. And, you know, that WTF moment for this trailer was that shot, you know, building to building car jump. But also, but in the, because the first trailer, it was the cars getting flying out of the plane using parachutes to land. Uh, so, I guess maybe the next Furious 7 official trailer that's going to be longer because it's, you know, not Super Bowl ad. We'll probably have another WTF. There's probably like seven or eight WTF moments in this next film. That's going to make you really question, what? <laughs> but anyways, guys, what did you think of the new trailer? What did you think especially of that final shot of the car going from building to building? I really want to know what you guys think. Let me know in the comment section below. That's my reaction. That's my thoughts. I can't wait for Furious 7. I'm really ex interested about how they're going to handle the story, the Paul Walker situation, and basically if they decide to continue on without Paul Walker and what they're going to do. Who knows, but we'll find out. But like I said, the trailer looks good. Furious 7, the movie, looks like it's going to be good, so I'm excited. So once again, let me know in the comments what your thoughts on about this movie and this new trailer especially. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Peace.